Good morning. We're going to take a derivative of a logarithmic function. Uh, it's y equals the ln of k times x, where k is a constant. And I think the reason this problem was in the book was because uh, they wanted you to see that any time you have the uh, natural log of a constant times x, you get a, a similar result. Um, I could use the chain rule, but I think I'm going to use uh, logarithmic properties instead. Yes, I'm going to because I like it better. Uh, so I'm just going to use logarithmic properties to change uh, the ln of kx. So I get y equals uh, the ln or the logarithm of, of a base to a product of, in the argument is the logarithm of uh, one of the arguments. It's a sum of the logarithm the logarithms of the argument. So in other words, you can break it up the logarithm of kx into the, log, the natural log of k plus the natural log of x. Now, I don't even have to use the chain rule in order to find y prime. y prime, well, the derivative of ln of k, well, k is constant, that's just zero. And the ln of x is one over x times one over the ln of the base. The base is e, one over ln of e is one over one, which is one, so we say y prime equals 1 over x. And that will work out any time you have a constant attached being multiplied by the argument of the ln.